Okay, here I am on our class website, and I'm going to go up and go to today. And we've already done the random event. Um, right now you're watching the bell ringer. And then you'll finish up your skeleton. You need to get that done. And then you'll do your first um, Pixlr um, project. Well, actually, just assignment. This should take not very long at all. So it says you'll use Pixlr. And so go ahead and open Pixlr. And you're going to log in. Click log in. And I want you to use... I want you to use a um, sign in with social providers. So click right there and then choose Google. And you'll click which account, your school account, and it might ask you if it can use your school account and you can say yes. So we're going to go on down to the editor, not express but editor, launch that. Now there are four ways you can get an image in Pixlr. You can create a new image, open an image from a computer, open an image from a URL, open an image from library. We're going to use open image from computer, but we need to get the image. The image is back on the class website. It's this one right here. So I'm going to write and click save image as, and I'm going to save it to my desktop. Now, I'm going to go here and click open image from computer because now it's on my computer so it should be on my desktop so here we are we've got our image in and we need to make these colors the keys that they use and if you can see here it says like this the pinky is Q A and Z so I've got to use red for Q A and Z I have to use exactly that red, so I'm going to come and get the color picker and click on red, and it changes it to red. I'm going to go get the bucket and fill in the red and the Q. If you can get it in the, in the middle, that's good. And the Z. Then um, this one says space bar, so I'm going to click on the color picker, go to space bar, get the bucket, Fill the space bar. Okay, the shift, the cap, and the tab, those are also red. Over here, those are pinky. And the shift, enter, and backspace, those are also um, brown for this pinky. They just didn't put them all on there. So you need to um, fill in all of these. Your numbers will be left empty. There are no numbers on this one. When you're done, you're going to go up to File and go to Save. And you can save it as a JPEG. You can save it as anything. I'm going to put my name with it so I know where it is. And I'm going to hit OK. It is once again saving on the desktop, so that's why I renamed it. Now, I'm not going to turn it in through Google Classroom today. I'm going to take it over to something called a Padlet. So you open the Padlet, and everybody's work will go here. I'm going to... Um, make it a little smaller and get it on my desktop and here's Pixlr and I'm gonna take mine drop it right on there and there it is my name's on there but if it wasn't I would just click right there and title it my name and you are done good luck